plugins. You can do really cool things with them. Once you've installed them, that is. This time on Solving. Hey, and welcome to Solving. Yes, I am an annoying cartoon in the corner. Sorry, little things. These days, most plugins come with an installer, although most effects presets don't. Don't panic, though. It's all pretty simple. Oh, and hang around until the end where I'll share a tip with you that saves me hours every time there's a new version update. Make sure After Effects isn't open. Close it if it is. Then navigate to where you have installed the software. In my case, that's the C drive, Program Files folder, Adobe, then After Effects. That's a folder, even though it's got an icon. Inside that folder, you'll see a shortcut for After Effects, another shortcut, and a folder called Support Files. Open that folder. Scroll down to Plugins and open that. Now paste your AEX file directly into here. Assuming you trust the source, have virus scanned it anyway, and check the README file for its own instructions. And that's it! Open After Effects and go look for your plugin in the effects menu. Oh sorry, there's one last element that's crucial to your success. In order to put out good feelings, please consider booping the like button. It's a little different for preset files. They end in FFX. With After Effects closed, navigate to your Documents area, Adobe, and then open the current version of After Effects. In there is a User Presets folder. Just go ahead and copy the FFX files straight into here. And that's it. But here's that tip I mentioned earlier. Create a folder anywhere you know you won't delete. In my case, I call the folder After Effects Plugins. In that folder, save a copy of the User Presets folder, Save copies of any plugin installer files and any connected emails. In short, anything extra you have bought or found or made for After Effects. Then, when each new version rolls around, just work from top to bottom of the contents. Before I did this, it used to take me three hours to find all the details, log into the various websites, download the installers, troll through old versions for user presets. I bought a new PC recently, and I was done in less than 45 minutes. And if you liked these tips, check out my Solving playlist where I have loads of quick tutorials.